Google has released a light version of the Google Search app for Android called Google Go, packed with a ton of helpful features. I'm Jessica from TechBoomers.com, and in this video, I'll be showing you how to get and use Google Go on Android. Now let's get started. To get Google Go, open the Google Play Store on your Android device and search for Google Go. When you find it, tap Install. Once the installation is complete, tap Open to check out the app. You'll notice that the Google Go homepage offers many different features and apps. The Search feature is of course for classic Google Search. When you tap Search, you'll be shown the current top trending search phrases. Tap one of these phrases to see its search results, or type in whatever you'd like to search and tap Go. The voice search feature is quite similar, but allows you to say what you want to search out loud so you don't have to type it. When you're browsing a website, you can have Google Go read text out loud so you don't have to read it. Tap the play button at the bottom of your screen while browsing a web page to make use of this feature. You'll see the text lighting up karaoke style at the bottom of your screen as Google Go reads to you. Tap this area to access playback controls to pause, rewind, or fast forward. Tap the stop button if you want to stop Google Go reading out loud. One of my personal favorite features of Google Go is the Lens feature. This is like a visual version of Google Translate mixed with a visual search feature. It allows you to get a better understanding of words you're seeing around you. Let's say you're looking at something written in another language. Take a picture of it using the Google Go Lens feature and tap Translate, and you'll be able to read the text in a language you can understand. You can even tap listen and have it read to you out loud. Or tap search to learn more about it. This is such a useful feature. Tap images to do an image search. Google Go will automatically show you a selection of popular image search categories, but feel free to type in whatever type of image you're looking to find. Similarly, the GIFs feature is the same thing, but for animated images. Tap YouTube to launch the YouTube app on your device. Tap Downloads to view any files you've downloaded while browsing. In addition, Google Go has some built-in web apps like Facebook and Instagram. This makes it easy for you to access your favorite sites. Tap Add App to browse other available Google Go web apps. If you see one you want to add to your Google Go homepage, Simply tap and hold on the app. To remove one of these web apps from your homepage, tap and hold on its icon. Then tap Remove. That does it for this walkthrough of the Google Go app for Android. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, we'd love it if you'd hit the thumbs up button below and subscribe to our channel. We put out great new videos like this twice a week, every Tuesday and Thursday.